Hey, you there, watching this video, are you ready to see the one and only Dr. Lovecat kick some ass as a sniper and profit a Bill's hat under 10 minutes? Well, watch this video and you'll be able to find out how you can profit a Bill's hat under 10 minutes. Let's go, peeps. Let's do this. Peeps, guess who it is? Totally not Dr. Lovecat. Maybe. Um, yeah, it's Dr. Lovecat. Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? And, like you heard the intro, you're gonna profit Bill's hat in under 10 minutes. And this is by Dueling, as you can see. I'm kinda starting to kick ass. I uh, started off grade, one to nothing. And I did win at the end, so I kinda spoiled it for you guys. But these badass kills can't handle them as you can see I wasn't expecting him to be down there and it, it was a pretty crazy fight to be honest my heart was pounding um, this wasn't even like 10 minutes this was actually like before I found the guy and all that you got you got to find somebody to duel and for a certain amount like I dueled somebody for um, like a year but before and I did lose he was actually quite good I wasn't expecting him to um, be that good but anyway I've won quite a few buds before and I feel like this is a pretty good way to profit if you are um, pretty good in TF2, if you have the skill. And you don't only have to play Sniper to duel, you can play as a Scout, you can play as a um, Heavy. Heavy is like the least common duel, I guess. But people still do it. I, um, I actually middleman for a Heavy duel a few days ago. And some guy uh, was dueling for a Temo Shanter with a smoking effect, it was painted lime for a strange festive um, mini gun, so it was actually quite fun to watch. They were both pretty good, it was a pretty tight fight, it was like 20 to 17, it was actually quite intense, and I got to um, middleman that. But anyway, as you can see, it's getting pretty tight here, and he kills me right here, but guess what? He dies as well, so <laughs> that was pretty, uh, pretty funny to watch. But it gets even better and better, and of course, some dumbass pyro had to air blast me. But thanks to him, I got another kill, so it's like 4 to 1 or 5 to 1 now. And I got a pretty quite good lead here. And getting closer to that Bill's hat, it is painted Team Spirit, so. And I've done this many times, like I said. You should give it a try, and don't start with like earbuds or unusuals. Even go for a refined. That's, that's still like a hat, basically, so. If, if you don't feel like risking it, or if you feel like you just want some nice, easy profit, try to find somebody your own skill level, and just play with them, have some fun. Um, you don't even have to do this for, um, for, for, for a stake, you can just go for nothing. And to do this, just get a dueling minigame. Those are like the two guns um, crossing each other, and that allows you to keep the track, like the game tracks it for you. And it's it's a good item, and it only costs like a reclaimed or so. You can unbox it, but why pay a key for it if you can pay reclaimed? <laughs> Quite the difference. But anyway, you can also um, lock the the class you um you want to play with, so your opponent and you can switch classes during the duel. And I never really got to um, the point of how many, how much it goes to, but you can usually select it. And make sure you have a fair opponent, so when you guys actually finish at a certain mark, um, they change the teams, so the duel ends and it says that they will lose. But, as you can tell, I'm actually quite a bit ahead of... ahead now. <laughs> Sorry about that. But I'm actually quite uh, ahead now, and getting closer to that build stat gets pretty tense here. But, nobody kills nobody here, so... And the duel continues. I try to see if he's here, but no he's not, and jump down, and try to find him. But it was actually, like I said, it was a quite an intense duel, although I had a quite um, quite a lead, it was, my heart was still pounding, guys. It's uh, Especially if you have a high stake, this is kind of like spy crabbing, but with less risk if you know you're good in TF2. So it's actually really worth it, um, but there are some concerns to it, there could be a, a lag, or... A connection problem and as soon as you leave the game you lose and you lose the item as well because it's not really fair if you 
if um, if you leave the server and they don't get the item, that's basically scamming and running away. That's kind of like leaving a spycraft duel. But I did bring a middleman. He's been middle. Uh, he's been a middleman for a while now for me, and he's a fair guy. He he gives the items to the winner. He is my friend, but not real life. But he's actually a really nice guy. I've lost a duel before. He has given the opponent the item, and it's pretty fair. You just gotta be fair with it. It's it's a game, but. It is, it is tough to lose, but what can you do, right? But there's some good profit. But anyway, for the ending kill now, it's about to end. And it's been a pretty tough duel. Heart was pounding, hands were shaking. And boom! Are you ready? Open up the doors. Let's go, let's go. Boom, body shot. That was kind of like a pussy move, but by me and by him. But here it is, I got the items. It was five refined, a key, my pink rubber hood of arms, those are my items, plus a Team Spirit Billsat. So that's around $10 USD, which is quite the profit. I believe it is USD, yeah, I think. Or maybe that's Canadian dollar, but anyway, I got the items. I offered him the five refined because I kind of felt bad. Like, usually when I win, I just kind of feel bad for the person, but it's alright. He didn't want it. He was really f a fair sport, I guess, and. Yeah, so I got the item, and I'm planning on doing more duels, maybe I'll record them, maybe it'll be like a higher stake, but you should stay tuned to see them. But guys, um, I would like to thank you guys for watching, and thank you so much for a thousand subscribers. Please tell your friends about this channel, subscribe, uh, like it up, and have a great day. Bye guys.